ASU poked and prodded their way to a 49-7 victory last Saturday against UTSA. The Roadrunners are hoping that the Baylor doesn't have the bite to do the same thing this weekend. Uh, I expect them to come out and, and, and want to redeem themselves. I expect us to want to come out and, uh, and improve on our performance from a week ago. Uh, it is behind us. There's a lot of things and areas that we need to improve on. I think we're making strides in those areas uh, to improve. And so I'm expecting us to come out and, and compete to the fullest and represent ourselves and play to the best of our ability uh, and to match the intensity and not only the intensity, but the execution of this football team that we're about to face. Oh, really just playing hard. Last year we went down there and we played hard. We had we had something on our mind that we wanted to get accomplished in, and we had the same thought this year. We know they're going to come out and try to hit us in the map, but like I said, our plan is to hit first. So, I mean, they, they have, they, they're they going to come in here and they're going to want to win, but we want to too. So, like I said, we just got to have that same mentality of strike first and just do what we need to do to, to win. Really, really looking forward to, to performing well on our stage uh, in our venue um, for, for our university, for our football team, for our city, and for our, our veterans and active military members as well. Coach Frank Wilson is hoping last year's victory against Baylor, their first Power 5 win, inspires the team this weekend at the Alamo Dome. With Sports Tonight, I'm Kyle Spieshock. You're watching Sports Tonight, San Antonio's only nightly 30-minute sportscast with exclusive sports coverage you won't find anywhere else.